From beginning to end. Oh my god, them Swisher girls are turning me on. We need to hit that up. Yeah, baby. Oh, you're the one that got Stop filming. Put your goddamn pants up, man. What's wrong with you? Hey, hey, hey. You're hey, not wearing hey. boots, though. You're throwing me off. Curtis. Oh. Man, Curtis got eight up for his house. All the time, he works 70 hours a week, and he makes $600 a week, and he only keeps 40 of them. 40 bucks. They take the rest of that shit, dude. I don't care, Curtis. I love they you. Know I love you, Curtis. Like, Curtis they're man. calling you out on your child support pool. I know you, dog. Hey, dog. It's okay. hey, for real, man. I'm going to I owe 67. But, man, I, have a, I have a black baby, too. I feel you, dog. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Not for real, though, man. You need to learn how to use a towel, man. You need to... There you go. Man, we almost hit the thing, man. We got right to the edge of Corpus, dude. We're oh, running out of gas. So boss. Everything was sick. fucking trash, dude. Every like, gas station was out of power and shit. We're like, oh man, we are so fucked. That's why we're out there bringing it in. But yeah, we were at the bar last night, fucking. Woo! It fucking hurt, man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we were all having fun. I go outside and smoke a cigarette. And the man's like, look at my mom. got turned sideways, dude. Just everything was just. Dude, I'm driving like tail fucking shit. Big man's kids are calling. Ooh, that's power. And he's like, oh, y'all are fine. Apparently, the fucking tornado ripped through there. Cow went missing. Yeah, yeah, roof got torn off. Cow went missing. Like, right next to these houses, everything got fucked up. Everything got demolished. I was like, Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. We kind of adopted that as our tribe call, dude. Ooh, yeah. You ever take it down? All over? Dude, I use that shit on that Batman that Rudy did on me, dude, and that shit fucking feel like that, you know? Yeah, Rudy? This, yeah, Rudy Martinez? Yeah, he's out in California. I was with him over in Vegas. And we were talking, just shooting shit, and he's like, dude, he's like, you doing anything Sunday? And I was like, no. He's like, let me tattoo on you. And I was like, I ain't got no money. He's like, I don't care. And I was like, alright. I was gonna have him work on my hand. He's like, no, let me do something badass. I was like, alright. He's like, what do you want? I was like, Batman. <laughs> Batman. <laughs> Damn, dog, that's fucking badass. Yeah, about eight hours. Yeah. About third day, using this shit on there. I peeled it off and I was already playing. What the fuck? I was walking around Vegas that night with this on. Like, we went, we, I got that tattoo, went straight to Vegas, went to a strip club, picked up strippers, and party till like nine in the morning, dude. I went to one strip club and took all the strippers to another strip club. My, ah. my bank called me that day and they were like, hey, are you okay? And we're like, yeah, why? And they're like, I took out a thousand dollars last night. Like, uh, yeah, I've been working out with Zach. He's that big son of a bitch. I don't know if y'all watch the, the Needle Boy show that we have, but he's a huge son of a bitch. I'm working out with him, that guy kills me up. Zach, the guy with the fucking full legs? Yeah. Yeah, yeah he's. He, he look like a big dude. Yeah, I, I saw him yeah look at me. I'm a buck fifty, man. That kid's like almost fucking 350 pounds. I'm trying to ass on his head, dude. He was in there doing a thousand, he was doing a thousand pounds squatting this shit with his legs. I'm barely doing 300. Like, <laughs> How's it going with the shop? Uh, I fired my apprentice. I didn't hired me as the apprentice. Took me on as the apprentice. I should have been my apprentice for a little over a month now. Why you always eat with my long? What's that? <coughs> right now? No. I got nine guys that work for me, dude. I gotta keep my own. He still keeps going. Me and Vulgar, like, I'm talking about Jason, listen to this shit. There's kids in there, man. There's a big ass black dude. Three little boys sitting right behind us. So Jeremy's like, dude, shut up. He keeps going at it. So I'm sitting right behind him. So I can get the shit out of the back of his chair. And he had a beer. So a beer shot up, got all over him and his old lady. He got real fucking pissed off. He was all, oh, blah, 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 blah. So. He gets up and he leaves in the hallway. I was like, all right, cool, let him blow it off and he'll come back. You know? Everything's kosher. No. He wants to run his fucking mouth in the hallway. I think I'm a bitch and I'm just gonna sit there and let him do this shit. I was like, fuck this. I took my glass off and threw him at my assistant. And I was like, no, 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 that ain't happening. So, uh, you're like the founder of Talk Shit Your Head. 
That dude, huh? Look at the humidity you just did to the lens. You fogged it up, yeah, dude. That's fucked. Yeah. Enter the Ryan next to the back. 